So sometime back in the middle of summer, I reached out to a few friends on Facebook because I was putting together a collage of gratitude journals, dr gratitude journal notes. And one of the exercises in the gratitude journals told me to collect love letters from other people. Um, love letters as in what they appreciate about me. So I did this and um, I... I was just reading through just a few of them and I cannot believe how touched I am with some of the things some people had to say. I didn't, I didn't, you know, I don't know if it's because I'm a Taurus or it's just because of the way I grew up, but I always felt like I was not, I always felt like nobody really appreciated me the way I appreciate other people. I appreciate everyone in my life so incredibly much and I feel like I don't receive that back a lot of times and it makes me very sad. So I was just reading one of the notes that my friends wrote me and one part really made me so happy. I'm gonna read it to you. I was very moved by your concern for Duane during show choir. The way you embraced him when he arrived late during the performance brought tears to my eyes. I thought I was just hugging him. I thought I was just hugging him and I didn't really think anybody would think much of it. I didn't even know that I would, I would move this friend in this way that when she observed me hugging Duane, that it brought tears to her eyes. In fact, in fact, if anything, I thought I was being maybe of a, of a nuisance because I was supposed to be preset backstage, and I was, I was preset, but I, I, I just had to, I had to hug Dwayne when he came. Um, he was having a tough day, but I didn't know. I didn't know I could touch somebody like that. I... I didn't. And it makes me so happy. It makes me so incredibly happy that I did. Because all I want is to feel appreciated. And that's why I always see myself working with people. I can't see myself working at, at, at a desk all by myself. I love being of service to other people. I have a genuine care for other people. I want to learn about their lives. I want to learn about them. I want to learn what makes them cry, what makes them laugh. I want to be there for them. I feel like I don't have any buddy like that in my life and I feel like that's why I want to be there for other people and I appreciate you guys so much too it means so much to me when you do leave a comment below when you do reach out to me and say hey you've touched me in this way and you've motivated me you've you've inspired me you've changed me and it just it just means so much to me to feel appreciated and I haven't had a lot of that in my life but reading this note now I just feel, I just feel so happy that I've, I'm able to make an impact in somebody's life. Cause there was a point in my life, and I spent many of my days still like this, that I thought if I died, you know, people would, I mean, they would be sad, but they would just get over me because I'm, I'm not that significant in life. I haven't changed people's lives. I was only in their, I only existed. I only existed and and then I'm gone and it's not a big deal but I just feel really happy oh, I feel so happy I haven't taken out these notes I haven't ever read these notes and I got them quite a while ago. I put them away because I always knew that there was going to be a day when I'm having a tough day or when I'm bored and I'm feeling uninspired in life that I would open this box and hopefully it would 
bring it would it would bring me joy and it has it has so much I want to thank Katie and I want to thank Edmund and I want to thank Warda so much for giving me this note giving me giving me these notes even the one that was super short I loved it so much so lonely sometimes that maybe I trap myself in my own mind and I don't realize how much I do matter in this world. Maybe I do matter. Maybe I am significant and I do make a difference. I just haven't had a lot of reassurance in my life. And it feels so good. It feels so good to be reassured. It feels so good to be wanted. It feels so good to be wanted. I don't think I've ever cried in a YouTube video before. <laughs> and I didn't think the first time that I would be crying in a YouTube video, it would be out of happiness. I'm so happy. I am so thankful. And now I'm gonna write I'm gonna write some holiday cards to some of my friends and pour my heart into it. I mean every word I say and hopefully their words touch them as deeply as I was touched today. I didn't even finish reading reading the later half of her note yet. Thank you so much. Thank you.